Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. Today we will be doing very cute painting that is unicorn. This uh, painting is requested by my little friend Alina and let's enjoy the video. So uh, I am making this painting to gift her. So if you want to gift uh, any painting to anybody and you are doing it on a stretched canvas then you need to preserve it for a long time. So just prime the canvas with gesso as I am doing it and then uh, I am drawing some outline about uh, where I want a rainbow and clouds and unicorn. So I am just taking random colors which I want in background, you can take any colors and just apply it randomly. Always uh, start with faint colors uh, to blend when whenever you have to apply so many colors in the background. Now I am taking this makeup brush. This makeup brush uh, is very useful in blending in such pattern. So I am just holding it and only tip of its uh, bristles are touching the canvas and with a very light hand blending it in circular pattern so you can take any brush uh, but this makeup brush is very useful for me now I'm painting clouds just take white color and draw any random shape of cloud and make a outline to it I'm making outline with purple color you can take any other color uh, or any pink color or like that now I'm taking all the rainbow colors you take all the rainbow seven colors in your plate and then start drawing rainbow Paint uh, two lines at a time and uh, blend their uh, middle portion like this. So like this you have to blend their lines. This is a very cute painting even if uh, you don't uh, want this to draw on canvas and you you are moving to any new house and you, you want to decorate your child's bedroom then you can even paint it on your kids wall so this is good as wall painting also for kids room. I am just painting it as it is described by my friend Alina. 
she uh, actually guided me how to draw and how is the unicorn and its pink shoes and horn and everything so the in the pattern in which she wanted i painted it exactly the same I'm just making a darker outline of this cloud with the same purple color. Now you have to trace unicorn. You can take any unicorn print or draw it on paper and place carbon paper in the background and just trace it or you can cut it and place it where you want and draw the outline. Now again take the same rainbow colors but this time I have added the silver glitter color to every color especially for unicorn feathers. So just apply all the colors in the same manner. It just look uh, shiny by adding the glitter. So you can add it or skip it if you don't want. Now we will paint its tail with the same colors again, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, dark blue and purple color or violet color whichever you have. Now we'll make unicorn white and we'll draw other features with this glittery pink color. It is uh, not a plain pink color, it is with glitter. You have to let every layer dry like the background it should be dry first then start rainbow then let the rainbow dry and start your clouds and then again let it dry and then paint your unicorn and uh, never hurry and try to paint on the wet layer it will spoil your painting so let's draw the eye I'm painting this eye with pen actually uh, you can go with zero number brush also we have to outline the eye then make central black area and just remaining white area you have to cover with light sky blue color like this and now just make outline with black color with the brush or paint whichever you are comfort comfortable with
now i'll be given uh, splashes uh, so you just add some water in white color and take it on one brush and just tap that brush on ana with the help of another brush like this and such splashes look very very beautiful in the background now i will be just uh, adding some extra features like i had this pearl dropper uh, this pearl dropper gives a pearls like effect so i am giving this pearls on the tail and the feather area and now we'll be painting stars with with golden color i am painting the stars I will paint these stars with golden color and then I will add the powder golden powder over it You can add that uh, golden powder or else you can let it be if you don't want it looks good with the only golden color also but i wanted some extra shine to it so i sprinkled some powder like this just make sure the stars are uh, still wet and then add this powder to it and let it dry and stick to it and just reverse your painting and tap that on the floor or anything so our painting is ready thank you so much for watching see you soon